On 443 in the morning, it's 79 degrees this morning. Temperatures barely out of the 80s last night. The high humidity level really slows down the cooling process because water has a really high heat content. That just means it takes a long time to heat up a lot of water. That's typically why we see those thunderstorms at the end of the day. All of us are really experiencing this heat. It's near record warmth across areas of the southern plains, but for us, the heat and humidity combination will be the most uncomfortable portion of the day. Already in the 90s by about noon, 92 degrees, 94 by 3. You know, a 20% chance here and there. I do think there will be a couple of spotty showers, but not quite as abundant as what we will see in some of the afternoons that lead up to Thursday and Friday. So not much happening of course, weather wise right now, we've got enough heat and humidity, though, combined that the heat related illness possibility is a whole lot more vast today between 1 and 7 PM. You really got to monitor if you work outside how your body's responding to that heat. Any kind of extra precaution certainly does help. Shade is a big thing, too. If you, you have the umbrella, it's not raining. You can use it as just a little bit of shade because these are the heat indices that are predicted for 10 AM this morning, maybe even feeling like 102 in Tuscaloosa feeling closer to even the 90s when we get towards 8 p.m. as the sun is setting. Uh, we get into Tuesday and the heat index close to 102 again. So these heat advisories, you know, preventing your body's natural cooling mechanism, the sweating, because there's so much humidity out in the atmosphere, you'll notice it if you're not continuously hydrating, certainly. So just really, you know, take those breaks when you can and take it nice and slow so you can still keep up with your routine. So let's check those rain chances and notice by about three, four o'clock in the afternoon, we see a couple of these showers possibly uh, sporadically arriving on our live Doppler on Tuesday afternoon by about three, four o'clock. There could be a lot more action happening closer to the Chattahoochee Valley and in Montgomery. So I-59 and southward, I think Tuesday there may be some better rain chances. And then a system starts approaching from the Appalachians on Wednesday, Wednesday moving into Thursday. And that will take our temperatures a little bit farther down on the thermometer. Not a seasonal average so far, but at least as we head towards Saturday and Sunday will have lower humidity and temperatures will be in the low 90s. Back to you.